175, damn, we'll be out there for some time. There you go, it's a slot. Oh, there he is. Nah, probably not. That's a bite though, baby. Yes, sir. This is nuts. The amount of life here is crazy. Little rat. What's up, Bacala? Go on the side of these guys right here. Boom. All right, there we go, folks. Caught a last minute audible mission to come out of the boat with the boy DK. Little schoolie to start the day. <coughs> See you. <coughs> I'm dying. All right, let's go. Hell yeah, Cap. I woke up an hour late past my alarm. I absolutely sent it out east. Barely made it to the boat before sunrise. But uh, I think we've been outside the inlet for maybe five, six minutes now. Already caught four fish. There is bait, birds, fish everywhere, man. All the life I saw on the beach yesterday, well, I'm a part of it today, so let's go. Only home for a couple days here on Thanksgiving break. Had to make the most of it. Should be a hell of a morning. Fish blowing up right next to the boat. Oh yeah. That's a fish right there for sure. Getting smacked, come on. Come on and eat it, bro. Oh. There he is. There he is. Heads up, go over, around me. And I have a fish on it. Flip or die. Boom, and I'll be in smoking him. There we are, another little rat. Definitely some bigger fish mixed in here. Seeing peanut bunker out here, adult bunker. Look at them fish is blowing up right here. Right there. This is stupid, dude. There he is. Oh, missed him. Come back for it. There he is. There he is. There we go, dude. Every cast bite. No giant fish yet. I'm sure there's some bigger ones. I might switch up to a heavier presentation to get down deeper. I'll get them for you. There we go, a little schoolie. Oh yeah, right here, bro. That guy's on. Let's go, surf rat. That guy doubled up on the beach. Let's go. I'm in. Area. <laughs> oh, this is nuts, bruh. Wow. Oh my God. Yeah, right there looks good. There he is. Yeah, I'm on. Well, that could be a better fish. A little drag. So this guy sink down 10 seconds to the bottom or a little bit deeper. What do we got here? Slightly better fish. Yeah, that's a slot maybe, 28. All right, bigger fish on the bottom, that's for sure. Smack an NLBN, dude. All right, there we go. Biggest fish of the day. Maybe 26, 28 inches, somewhere around there. Send her back. So we're seeing a lot of surface action out here. Birds, bass busting, but most of the fish up top seem to be small. And we're trying to work this swim shot a little bit deeper. 
Because that fish wasn't a giant, but it was definitely a little bit bigger than the rats. It was catching up top, closer to the beach. All right, so NLBN caught us plenty of fish. You can see it is absolutely wrecked, but we're going to move out east, try to chase those birds. I'm going to switch up our bait here, try to get a little bit deeper, target those bigger fish if we can. Oh, yeah. All right, switched up to a big old heavy tsunami shad here. Got a gnarly feed, deep water. See if there's any big on the bottom. Yeah, a lot of big marks on the bottom. I'm letting it hit. Oh yeah, it's got crushed. Oh no. There he is. On the bottom. Oh. Fiend, fiend. All right, not a giant off the bottom, but other fish. Smoked, it barely fit that shad in his mouth. See ya. All right, boy. It's got marks on the bottom, DK. Oh, just got smacked, jigging it. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I went to jig it and it was just wait. Oh yeah, sit down. Boom. Flip or die. Little guy, see ya. Oh my gosh, all over down the bottom. Oh, just missed him. You break me off? No way. Just got broke off, dude. No way. Damn. Must have been a good fish, I guess. All right, well, lost that shad, unfortunately. Throwing on a little NLBN two ouncer here. Still the same idea, get that to the bottom. Had to find ourselves a good fish. Could we'll probably catch unlimited schoolies, but I'm looking for that slot plus. Love to get an over. There he is. Come on, be a better fish. Got some more weight, so it might be a slot. I don't know. Ah, nah, little guy. There we are. Got a little rat bass. Oh my god, that screen is insane, dude. That screen is nuts. Dude, they are all over the place down there. There he is. Boom. Schooly Fest 2023. These fish are just gorging themselves on peanut bunker and sand eels. I mean, that is just a fat, fat schoolie there. There he is. This guy's got a little bit of, a little bit of pull to him. Slightly bigger fish. Oh yeah, that's a fatty dude, that's the biggest fish of the day. So fat, here I got him. 20, yeah. 29. There we go, I was looking for a slightly bigger fish on the jig. 29 incher there. I'm actually gonna take this guy home too. Don't normally keep striped bass, but we will here for a couple of days on my Thanksgiving break. Bring the family some grub. Doubled up. DK's got one on the fly. Got one on the jig here. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude.
Boom, baby. There we go, baby. A little double up action, eh? Two little late November schoolies, man. Adios. Cheers. Cheers, man. Let's go, baby. Hell yeah. You. There we go, got a decent one on. Wasn't recording for the bite. Find our little slot here. Only fish really taking drag all day. Boom, baby. All right, it's a longer one. There we go, folks, another decent fish. Probably 28 or so, 27. See you, bud. Let go of my hand. Boom. There he is. Get some weight to this guy. Oh, that's a good one there. Better sized fish for sure. Oh, that might be the biggest one. Not a bad fish. Another slot, baby. Oh my God, look how fat he is. Sweet, he's got a quick measurement on this guy. Biggest one of the day, 30, 31. There we go, guys. New PB on the day, 31 inch right there. Fat, fat fish, dude. Cap, putting us on them, dude. Dairy free, check them out. See you, bud. You. All right, so far, my, my theory's working. Jigging on the bottom's gotten some bigger fish, not giants, but you know, we're catching some slot size fish, 31, 29, probably had a 28. All right, let's get back down to the bottom. Plenty of fish down there. Such a sick morning, man. Oh, there's some fish down there. Dude, hold Derek. Last plug choice of the day. Throwing a big old mad man at Spook. Got maybe 20 minutes left. DK's a hardworking man. He's got to go into work early this morning. So, uh, see if we can't catch a fish up top. Come on. I need a triple up here. Come on, fish. Popped off? No. Oh, we just ate it again. Come on. Oh, it's got smoked. Tripled up, baby. <laughs> Triple. Oh, he just broke me off. This broke off everything. No, I just bought that popper. It was $32. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. All right, guys, on the way in, had to stop and make a couple casts. There are birds, bass blowing up everywhere. Day just does not want to end. Oh, there he is. They didn't even watch him eat, it was so far away. Hell yeah, hell yeah, dude. In the inlet, baby. All right, there we go, folks. Little schoolie in the inlet, sending them back. Dude, on our way back to the dock, came in, birds fastest diving everywhere. Such an insane morning, man. Fish like almost every cast. Woo! All right, folks, well, we made it back to the dock, mostly safe and sound. DK and Tommy just had to rip out of here. I was trying to get a quick time lapse of us unloading and uh, cleaning up the boat. But my phone and tripod decided to plump right into the bay down there. So thankfully we're good. Got the phone back after about 20 minutes of digging around with the net. My phone's currently on life support right now uh, in a bucket of rice. So before I threw it in the rice, I was able to get all the footage off safely on my Mac. So at least my phone decides to kick the bucket. 
we uh we got the footage from today so with that being said i got a beautiful striped bass right here normally i really don't keep stripers even though i target them majority the fall run but since i don't live in new jersey in the fall anymore and i'm just here for a couple days on break decided to keep this beautiful 29 incher and uh i'm really intrigued to see what's inside his belly here this is a fat fat fish might be pushing eight ten pounds just with all that food in there also if you're wondering how I uh, am recording right now if my phone's on rice. I do have an extra backup phone, an old phone that I broke that pretty much is just a, uh, a backup camera for me. So let's cut this beautiful bass open. Such a pretty, delicious fish. Plenty of meat on there. It's gonna taste absolutely delicious. I'm wasted absolutely nothing. There we go, two beautiful striped bass fillets. Those are gonna taste absolutely delicious later. Here in New Jersey, you're allowed one fish between 28 and 31 inches as of uh, this summer. So pretty slim slot to get your keeper there, but ideally gonna ensure that the striped bass have a healthy future. Now the exciting part, get to pop open this full stomach. See what exactly is inside. Oh, oh, no way. Not exactly what I thought I'd see. That is an entire adult bunker there. A whole bunker, bro. That's why it was so full. <laughs> That's nuts. Look at that bunker, man. I thought that this fish was gonna be absolutely loaded with peanut bunker and sand eels. That's mostly what I've been seeing the past couple of days, but there was a school of adult bunker this morning that we saw. That's a, uh, a pretty big bait for that guy there. So folks, thanks for tuning into this video. Another exciting fall run day here on my Thanksgiving break. Huge shout out to DK, uh, AKA Dairy Free Fishing on Instagram. For, uh, for taking me out, he said he only had a couple hours before work, wanted to go six to nine. I think we ended up fishing till like 10. And then I was at the dock for about another hour, digging my phone out of the mud. But yeah, gonna enjoy some delicious striper cakes, have a pretty chill rest of the afternoon. Just really an incredible scene out there. Birds, bass, and bait for miles. I mean, just all over, it was going off. So it was really a chaotic day from waking up an hour late, racing a thousand miles an hour down here to enjoying nonstop blitz fishing. It really was a chaotic but fantastic day on the water. Thank you all for tuning in. I have one day left in New Jersey on my Thanksgiving break before I ship it back down south for a couple weeks. So uh, stay tuned for that video. Should be an epic day going out tomorrow with Captain Chris on the Reaper. So I'll catch you guys in the next one. You.